Hello and welcome to Rashi Speechless. Today's video is going to be another skin combo video and today's going to be Young Adult Group. Let's get into this video. This video is going to be a Never Skin combo video. And today's going to be Young Adult Groot, which is part of the Guardians of the Galaxy pack that came out in the item shop yesterday. And the actual pack will cost you $28.99 you're from the US. Or if you're from the UK, like myself, it costs you £21.99p. Obviously, it may be more or less depending where you are, obviously, around the world. The pack itself comes with the Young Adult Groot, Drax, and Mantis, and their respective backbones and pickaxes. You also get two emotes as well. And it's a bit more on the expensive side for some people. But I really like the skins and I decided to make 10 combos for Young Adult Groot. It's part of the Guns of Galaxy set like all the other skins are obviously introduced in Chapter 5 Season 2. Let's get into first combos back then. Which is a sapling Groot, part of the Groot set introduced in Chapter 2 Season 4's Battle Pass. And there's a version of Groot in the Chapter 2 Season 4's Battle Pass. It's pretty cool we do have a version that people can play with if they didn't play in that season. I see it's basically like a dancing up sapling Groot. It's pretty cool to be fair. I do like this back a lot. It goes very nicely with this skin. Pickaxe is the Leviathan Axe, part of the Oathbreaker set, introduced in Chapter 2, Season 5. Definitely my favourite game in Legends series, Pickaxe I do own. And this is Kratos' Pickaxe, and Kratos and the Leviathan Axe will be coming back very soon. It's got updated in the files on Tuesday with the updates, so it's definitely come back, can come back any day now. So if you are looking out for Kratos or Leviathan Axe, they should be coming out very soon. And when Kratos does return, I'll be making update combos for Chapter 5 for him, and potentially make new combos for Le Leviathan Axe as well. I've already done Pickaxe combos, but I've got a few new ideas on which skins I can use it with. Glider for all combos is a root wing, which is part of the group set in Houston Chapter 2 Season 4's Battle Pass. I thought I'd use this for the brown design, works very nicely, obviously it's groups contrail from that season. If you don't have this, you can use any other glider or umbrella that's brown or green themed, it'd work nicely if there's a little bit of brown or green on, on the group skin as well. Contrail is Saplite, which is also part of the group set. In Shoes Chapter 2 Season 4. If you don't have this, you can use anything brown or green themed. I guess you could say tree themed or plant themed would work nicely for the contrail. The first weapon wrap is this one right here, which is a fully brown designed weapon wrap, which is Rogue Archaeology, part of the Indiana Jones set in Shoes and Chapter 3 Season 3. Battle Pass, here's the secret skin from that season. I know it's not the exact brown, but it does go very nicely for the fully brown theme. Let's move on to the next combo, which is combo number two. I thought I'd go for a Guardians of Galaxy themed back bling, which is Rocket from the Chapter 2 Season 4 Battle Pass, part of the Rocket set, as you see here. It's basically like a pet themed back bling. Pretty cool, I do like this a lot. I use it with Drax there, so I thought I'd use it with Groot as well. Pickaxe is the old Woody, which is part of the Save the World set, introduced in Chapter 1 Season X. Obviously, if you have Save the World, you can get this for basically leveling up your pickaxe. I mean, you can level up your pickaxe and upgrade it, so if you upgrade it enough, you basically get this design. I'm not sure exactly which stage you've got to get your pickaxe to, but I know it's definitely you put for upgrading your pickaxe in Save the World. The old Woody just works very nicely for the wooden theme. Weapon wrap for this combo is from the Chapter 2 Season 4's Battle Pass, which is Groot's weapon wrap from that season, which is Sap. Works very nicely for the brown and green design. The hardest part for like combo with the young adult group is definitely finding weapon wraps to combo with the brown and the green. Let's move on to combo number three now. Back bling is the Arroyo pack, part of the custom set introduced in Chapter 2, Season 2's Battle Pass. The style that works the best is default, as you see with like the fully brown design, also the grenades green as well. You can also maybe use brown camo, if you want to change it up a little bit, that would also work nicely, but I decided to go with default. Pickaxe is a simply, or simply, <laughs> simple sledge, which is part of the John Wick set introduced in Chapter 1, Season 9, and this is John Wick's pickaxe, or one of the two John Wick's pickaxes, which we have this one, and the Wick's katana. This works very nicely, mainly for the brown on the sledgehammer. Let's move on to the weapon wrap now, which is combo number three's weapon wrap, which is this one here, which is Drift Wood, part of the Scallywag set, introduced in Chapter 1, Season 8. I thought I'd just use it for the wood design, as you see right here. Works pretty nicely. Let's move on to combo number four now. For this one, I thought I'd use the Expedition Bag, part of the Indiana Jones set, introduced in Chapter 3, Season 3's Battle Pass, using it for the brown of the bag, to be fair. It's not the exact brown, but it does work pretty nicely. Pickaxe is a Whip's Katana, part of the John Wick set, in Houston Chapter 5, Season 1, and this is the most recent John Wick pickaxe we got. You can also use this as a back bling as well. If you don't have the Expedition bag or don't want to use it, you can use the Whip's Katana as both the back bling and the pickaxe as well, would work nicely. The weapon wrap for this combo is this one right here, which is the Life's a Beach, in Houston Chapter 2, Season 7, animated weapon wrap. 
pretty cool. It has a little bit of brown, a bit of yellow as well. And basically, it's animated with like the footprints going across the actual sand itself. It's a pretty cool looking minecraft. Goes nicely with the design or color scheme of the young adult Groot. Let's move on to combo number five. Now, for this one, I thought I'd use the Gaming Legends series back bling, which is a green herb, part of the Styles team set in Shift Chat 2 Season 8. And this is a green herb from Resident Evil. And I'm just using a standard style for the green herb, as you see here. It has brown and a good bit of green as well. Pickaxe is the Steve's Bat. Part of the Stranger Things set in Shooter Chapter Fortnite OG, Season Fortnite OG, and works very nicely for the brown design. I was either going to use this one or I was going to use the throwback axe, which is basically the default axe from the Chapter 1 chapter one Season, which is basically the default pickaxe you get if you weren't using the pickaxe at all. And you got this in Chapter 2, Season 4, part of the Origin set. You got this for free, you just literally claim in the art drop, which is pretty cool. But either of those work nicely, or if you don't have either of these two, just use any other brown themed pickaxe would work nicely. Let's move on to the Wrap Wrap Plus combo now, which is this one here. Use it mainly for the, like, the brownie, the brown and the green design, which is Sun Print, part of the Sun Soldiers set. In Shooting Chapter 1, Season 8's Battle Pass. Works pretty nicely, to be fair, this is how it looks in the actual gun. Works pretty nicely. Let's move on to combo number 6. Now, for this one, I thought I'd use a cloak, and the cloak I'm using is a Marvel Series one, which is Cable Cloak. Part of the X Force set in Shooting Chapter 2 Season 2. As you see, it has a nice brown design. It's not the exact brown, but it does work pretty nicely, in my opinion. Pickaxe is Combat Knife, part of the Future War set in Shooting Chapter 2 Season 5. I'm pretty sure this is Sarah Connor's pickaxe. I may use it for the brown of the handle. I really do like this pickaxe a lot. It looks cool and also sounds cool as well. And the actual back bling, back bling? <laughs> the actual weapon wrap for this combo is this one right here. Which is the Pancake Posse, part of the Breakfast Bandit set in Shooter Chapter 2 Season 5, using it for the brown design. This is from the Chapter 2 Season 5 Battle Pass animated as well. Basically, Pancake with a bit of syrup on it as well. Works well, very nicely. It looks pretty cool on the weapon wrap as well. Let's move on to the next combo now, which is combo number 7. I decided to use another Marvel series backlink, and the one I'm using is Doctor Strange's, which is the book of Callistro. The book of C the book of Cagalistro, I think that's how I said Cagalistro, I can never ever say that word, but yeah, part of the Doctor Strange set, Institution Chapter 3 Season 2's Battle Pass, you see it has a nice brown and green design, I really do like this combo a lot, especially with this back bling, Pickaxe is the Hammers of Justice, which is part of the She-Hulk set, Institution Chapter 2 Season 4's Battle Pass, the pickaxe type I'm using is the Hammers of Justice, you can also use a, the Hammers, sorry, the Hammer of Justice, you can also use the Hammers of Justice, you see dual wield or single wield, Either one would work nicely. Works very nicely for the brown design. Let's move on to the weapon wrap now, which is this one right here. Is that the right one? Yeah, it's the right one. Make sure I wasn't using the wrong weapon wrap. I'm using Cleco, which is part of the Swole Cat set in Shooting Chapter 2 Season 2's Butter Pass. And this is Meow School's weapon wrap. At this stage, I was running out of brown weapon wrap, so I just basically popped this on. As you can see, there's a little bit of brown on it, so I thought I'd use it for that. And this is how it looks on the actual gun. Works pretty nicely. Let's move on to the next combo now, which is combo number eight, which is this one right here. And the background I'm using is a pet background, which is the Dodger. In Shooter Chapter 1, Season 8, Battle Pass. Many use this basically like in a log, which is pretty cool. Works very nice with the Groot skin. The star I'm using is the camo, because it's got a little bit of green on the camo design of the actual dog itself. So I thought brown and the green goes nicely with the group skin pickaxe is the spider ha spider hams mallet which is part of the cross of spider verse set in shooting chapter 4 season 2 and this is miles morales pickaxe use it for the brown design looks cool sounds cool as well because i've already ever used it but it does look very nice oh works very nicely for the brown obviously with the wooden theme weapon wrap i'm using for this combo is this one right here which is a gaming legend series weapon wrap which is mayhem in shooting chapter 1 season x and part of the Mayhem set. Basically the Borderlands weapon wrap. I wasn't sure what to use. I just thought I'd use this for the cartoony design. As you see right here. Let's move on to the next combo now. Which is combo number 9. This one I thought I'd use the Hollow Back. Which is part of the Boundless set. In Shoes Chapter 2 Season 4. And this is basically one of the two back things you can buy for the Cosmogen Superhero skin. And the sticker I'm using is the is, um, the group one. As you see right here. I'll see if I can find it quickly. Sometimes the actual stickers are quite hard, so the best way to do it is you go into your emotes and basically change it, put your sticker you want in the top, and it'll tell you like what the name is, and you can basically equip it in your emotes, it'll always be top left, which is pretty cool. Always a good way to find the one you want. So the sticker I'm using is Group to Link, which is basically like the Sapling Group Back Bling, but with like a sticker version of it, which is pretty cool. Pickaxe is the Donnie's Bow Staff, part of the TMNT set in Shooting Chapter 5, Season 1, and using it for the brown design. I know the purple don't work nicely, but the brown does. 
This is this is um Donatello's pickaxe, works very nicely. And the weapon app for this combo is this one right here, which is the Jeff's Desserts from the chapter Fortnite OG, season Fortnite OG Battle Pass part, the splitting image set. Use it for the brown design. There's two different browns. There's like light, there's like a darker brown and a lighter brown. And this is the Lil Splits weapon wrap. Let's move on to the final young adult Groot skin combos. Now, and for this one, I thought I'd use this back ring right here, which is the Coleco Co, the Coleco Co Nut, which is basically, as you see here, like a drink, which we've got like a coconut drink, which is pretty cool. Taste of is part of the Taste of Paradise set. Institution chapter four, season three, Bat Pie, Bat Post, Bat Pass. And it was the, um, what's it called? Paradise Meow School's back bling. Style is just a standard Coleco coconut, mainly for the brown. Like I guess the green of the straw does work nicely as well. But it works very nicely for the young adult group. And there's a um, brown color scheme, brown and green color scheme. The pickaxe is the Flora Colossus Fist, which is part of the Guardians of the Galaxy set in Shooting Chapter 5, Season 2. And this is the young adult group's pickaxe. I wasn't sure what else to use. I thought I'd use this one from the final combo. And then the final weapon wrap is this one right here which is the scan light i know it's more probably yellow than it is gold but it could work pretty nice or gold it's more yellowy gold and it is brown but i thought i'd use it so i didn't really have any other weapon apps to use obviously with any combos you can use any of the universal weapon apps obviously you can use any of the brown ones i use but obviously i don't like to reuse weapon apps so that's why i decided to use a different one and so i use this one which is from the item shop part from machine learning set in chapter three season four it's animated as well by many users pretty close to brown not exactly more gold than it is brown but still works pretty nicely in my opinion so that's all the young adult group skin combos done as i mentioned i will get mantis skin combos done but when kratos does come back to the art shop i'll make sure i get combos done for him also i'm not medusa the other day her second edit style so i'll make sure i get combos done for her pretty soon as well but if you ever do want to see any specific cosmetic related videos could be skin back bring pickaxe glider slash umbrella contract or weapon or anything over for related always feel free to let me know in the comments down below i'm always down to give something new a go but anyways that's pretty decent